Yeah, I mean, enemy team is just getting black. Oh my god! Uh. Um. So my team has forsaken me with the god tier 4 scaling lanes, no win con, no frontline, nothing. So we're going to go conk Briar there. Let's go. We don't have to play that game. We were going to lose. Let's go. Double last second dodge. Man, these lobbies are rough. I didn't want to play that one though. I'm not going to lie. Like my team drafted the most Omega shit draft on earth. Nice. All right. Yeah, so here's why this game's unplayable for my champ. I'm going to need my team to take the front the front seat here. Going to take the driver's seat. Bragus at any time E R's me away or just E's and walks away, okay? Kane hits R. Breaks my frenzy and just can just walk through the wall. And if I don't have Q, it's fucked. Way, if he just plays his fear correctly, he just runs away. Okay? Caitlyn, full trap combo. And Janna, shields on impact. Q's me way, R's me way. It is unplayable for my champ. Does my team care? No. Not for a second. They don't care at all. Kane wins in the Briar? No. Just annoying. Just annoys you. Briar can win. Kane can win. It's, it's an even match. A better player wins. Um, if he's... You know, let's say, for example, Kane goes for my team a lot, and I'm able to stun him free. But if I look for a Kane play, and he just R's, he can, you know, if he can R, go to a wall, Q over it, and then E away, then he doesn't die. So we both have good options. He has slightly more options than you. It's a, it's an even to Kane favored, but it's not that bad. It depends on how they play. Do you want to start red? Nah, just game dependent. Good junglers should be flexible. You should have a baseline plan of things that you like to do, and then flexible to do other things. Kane did a three camp with killing his bot side, so he's going to his top side now. So we're free to gank bot here. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to run around this bush in case this is warded. We're going to run very far around. They're going to ward right now. We're going to try and dodge that ward. Keep it pushing. So it looks like they might have sniffed us out here. Let's see where we're at. Doesn't, unless they warded like mid river, there's no way they know where we're at. I guess technically they could be on the crab. Not in that bush. Yeah, I guess they just took a recall. Very smart of them. I would like to play for one of these. So you can't just flat out kill the grub in front of Kane. You have to give him some time on it. So look for his mid laner in the meantime. And now Kane sacks this anyway. You want to make sure you get one of each. That way you get two, he gets four at worst. But at best, you just want to stop them from getting three. This jungle is looking pretty diffed right now. Really solid uh, move for me there. What if just mindly press W when he was in the grubs? Yeah, man, that's what we're trying not to do. Briar is already, like, you're already slightly holding yourself back picking this champ, right? So you got to be a little creative sometimes. There's situations where this champ is, like, the worst in the game. That other junglers don't have to deal with. So we just lock it in real quick. Again, Kane can't see you till he's out of the wall. One, two, three, W2. Ooh, heat up, heat up. And we have a winning jinx. And we have a win winning jinx. Nice, man. Game is over. GG, easy, peace. Dogs free. So what made that play good is, again, when Kane's in the wall... He can't see inside of bushes. He doesn't get that much vision, right? So I stay inside of the bush until he's committed so far that he's out of the wall, right? Because then he's down that huge cooldown. And then we just run him down with our team. Jinx gets excited and kills the guy that was 100 health. You get level 6 here and then you can actually look R. Um, He definitely just kills, yeah? That was a cringe play out of them, I'm not gonna lie. He does get vision, not inside bushes. He does not at all. He does not get flat out vision of you at all. If you're talking about the blob, the blob shows like the direction of people, right? But he can't see inside the bush at all. He doesn't know who it is, what it is, anything. He can assume, sure. But again, you just chill. Yeah, mostly just need to play for me and Jinx here. They're like kind of fanboying topside here. But uh, it'll be all right, not worried about it. All right, we need to lock in on these grubs. Our top side is weak. But if we can grab one, it's good. Give me one. Oh my god, we're so lit. We have no smite here. Probably don't have smite for the, until the third one, but with my team, we should just blast these. R out and then, or W out and then R in. Hit the three man.
Yeah, I mean, enemy team is just getting black. Oh my god! Uh. 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 Alright, did easy. Okay, but the W out though was W out R in, that's good, that's always good. Um Yeah, man, I don't know what I'm supposed to say. Did easy. Inner femboy? Femboy, man, I'm a girl. Wait, chill. No, I'm not. Now ask yourself, did anything I built this game matter? No. Right place, right time, right keys. Now, luckily, Kate did not play that combo perfectly, so we're chilling. Kane's probably topside here or here. You're the wrong right build is usually cope for people. Yeah, most of the time. What's up, bro? I'll be taking that, thanks. I don't know if we had to flash there as Diana, but good job, bro. I think they're just doing whatever. Would like to look for invades here, but it's kind of tough. Like, no one's on the map. If I go for this, it's like pretty troll. He's gonna look to W me, so we deny his Q by just hitting E. Again, when you start getting ahead, it's most important to deny camps. Why? Because they're worth two times as much as your regular camps. Because it's money that he would have gotten and money that you are now getting. We're in there. Play flash. Jinx is just demolishing tier 2 mid. Getting so greedy with lethality builds. I mean, against this team, like, it's not that bad because they, like, like you can go red cane full tank. That build's kind of bad right now. And then play the front line for your team by killing Aatrox with your team. Or you can play lethality, try and snowball kill Jinx yourself. With no Jinx, we really can't contest that rift, though they just get it. Bruiser with Hob? Yeah. This is one of the games where you want the early game help of Halo Bleeds to snowball the Kane matchup, but you also want to go Bruiser items for your team. Oh my god, Diana damage. You walk to the blue plant and then hit W. And then you miss because you went to the blue plant like a dumbass. Alright, Gate Wolves, don't go to team fights here. Going to team fights here, really stupid. You want to go to team fights now. Go to the blue plant and hit down. There we go. Now we're good. Oh, Frenzy Diff, pussy! Chill. Seen this before? You gotta be really smart about this! Oh my god, no. How clean is that, though? The W flash to break your own frenzy? Come on now. Good throw. I don't think we'll throw this game. But I did just die for 1k, so my bad. Shoot it deep, because you know they're running. Look at this. Ah! Thanks, bro. G-Unit. Sometimes you can go 1 for 1 on stuns there. I'm not really too worried about it in this match. Try and heal this. We have to heal through this guy. When he hits a spell, we have to hit W2. I live! Why would you throw it like that? I have the wall! He must have vision. Like, if he doesn't have vision, he thinks I go here, tries to jump over this wall, but if he has vision right here, then he knows that I pivoted back. So, here's what it is. My bad! My bad! That's what was the game when he chose red? Yeah, red form's kind of... Not gonna lie. Games are just bad people. <laughs> you just know them like that? <laughs> we should just force Baron with the inhib down again. We don't want to let him get too much farm for free. Because right now we will never see the light of day on mid lane farm ever again. I'm actually gonna skip Grump to go there faster. My team needs time anyway and Diana's not coming to this. So let her get in position, get her raid. Now I will say Kane is a champ that can easily 50-50. This guy is not playing to 50-50 this, so it's just fine. But any other situation, you would not try and 50-50 a Kane. They just sit in the wall for free and W smite. All right, our best. This could be 4v3. Off that hit. Everyone away from me. Again, I don't get any assists, just like last game. I'm going into their nexus. It is what it is. He's tanking, we're gonna do max DPS if possible. Ooh, is that the mid wave too? Let's go. Chill. Why didn't I just see? My bad, I forgot ID. Not Caitlyn testing, man, because he's gonna run me under the turret. Now 
Nice two. All right, Jen is up. Just these two here. Ow! All right, I didn't see that. Using W like this is usually pretty bad because you're gonna find Kane here and not have W, but it is what it is. Huge sweeper value. Insane sweeper value here. Again, if Kane ever goes into the wall, you can always just hit Q immediately, with or without Frenzy, and he'll immediately get out. Very important to know that. Because it's what successfully got that. That kill there. Where'd my Argo? Straight up. Sorry, you're still a cute little mage, little guy. Briar's better at killing waves than inhib, so just destroy the wave for your team. Ooh, Kane, bad W. All good. This one's looking pretty free here, not gonna lie, Jadeezy. Oh, I can't even kill Kate because she did that. No. Okay, GG. Dude, we are on this streak right now. Play Briar because she's cute as fuck.